Yo, yo, y'all hear me? Oh, hang on. Can y'all hear me? It's been a while since I've been on here, y'all. God bless. I pray that all you guys are doing well. Um, you know, I think I'm gonna go in the garage, actually. It's not that bad in here. But um, I pray that everybody's doing well. And thank you guys for coming back to this channel. I know it's been almost three years since I've actually posted anything. And um, I just wanted to talk about a few things briefly. And I'm gonna jump into the content that I do have. Um, for one, just thank you for coming back. For two, I'm alive, obviously, I'm here. Um, a lot of the things that I've been posting or the things that I've been doing have not been on this YouTube channel, um, but they are on my Whipaholic page on Instagram, which thank you guys, we've just hit over 200,000 followers. And I also post a lot on my TikTok, which thank you guys, we're almost at 32,000 followers, so it's been doing pretty good. Um, I started posting on here a little bit recently, um, but all in the short section, so all of the content that I've been getting from the car shows, haven't been in a six time, uh, 16 by nine angle, such as this one. But I do have a lot of content that I've been posting. So if you guys do wanna keep up with the cars and the car shows, go check out my shorts, okay? As far as these kind of videos, um, I do wanna do them a little bit more where I can travel to car shows and maybe record myself going to these car shows. And honestly, you guys, it wasn't really my intent to give up on this or to stop doing these videos. A lot of things had happened with life. If you have kept up with me, um, you know, this don't have to be a sob story or none of that. I just want to tell you guys straight up that, you know, my intent when I got the new Durango was to vlog, to do a lot of these things. In addition, when I got the new Durango, I had to go through a surgery. And after the surgery, my vehicle was stolen. So I didn't have much to record on. And to be honest, my motivation just kind of flew out the window with a lot of this. I'm going to keep it real with y'all. But, you know, I'm back. I do have a different vehicle now. Obviously, we don't have the Durango anymore. But... My intent is not to be worried about my vehicles. I kind of want to get back into grind mode the way it was even before I got these cars. And that was me just going to car shows, going to, you know, friends and meeting with new people and just doing videos and getting footage of other people's cars. It doesn't have to always be me. And I think that's really where my brand started to slope down a little bit. You know, Whipaholic used to be the person to go to every car show, get footage and videos of everybody else's cars. And then I got, you know, so consumed by just me and my vehicle, which ain't nothing bad. You know, we all deserve to have nice things in life, but they didn't took it from me, so whatever. But anyway, um, I do actually have footage that I never got to upload on here of the unboxing of the new wheels, um, videos of me like the first day leaving off the lot. So just because I'm not going to a car show right now and I don't have a lot of content, I just wanted to bring you guys some of the stuff that I wish I could have brought you guys a couple of years ago when everything was happening. And, you know, after these videos, you guys, the next time that I upload, Lord willing, is me going to a new car show, is me meeting new people, is me bringing you guys car content. And um, for now, I'm gonna be posting a lot in my shorts, like I said. I'm always gonna stay consistent on my Instagram channel because I just have a lot of videos and content um, that I can post on there. But for now, you guys, I'm gonna stop talking. I thank you guys for coming back to the channel. Uh, I'm going to bring you guys back two years ago. You guys are going to see the difference in my face. Um, you guys are going to see things that I wish I could have stayed consistent with just for the channel. But God had a different plan for me. God has a different plan for you guys. Um, and before we do start this, I just want to remind you guys, if things aren't going your way, that's because God's way is a lot much better. And, um, you know, just trust him and whatever he's got planned for you guys and don't give up. Don't give up on life. Don't give up on hope just because you feel like things aren't going your way. I would give up everything that I thought that I wanted in my life to have the life that I'm living right now. God has blessed me with the freedom to do what I want. I don't have to wake up and I don't have to work for nobody. Um, God has blessed me in ways that I couldn't even have imagined. And I'm happier than I've ever been. And I feel like I've had everything that I wanted, or at least that I thought that I wanted. And the joy of having God in my life is much better than all of that. So keep God in your life. Keep praying. Um, I'm thankful for you guys. And Lord willing, I can bring you guys much better content than this one. But thank you guys for tuning in. God bless. Peace. What is up, everybody? Um, decided to do a little vlog today. I wanted to bring you guys to the stores to show you guys the new rims for the Durango. Um, that hopefully is here any day now. Um, I did get some new rims. So these are not going to be for the Durango that you guys seen on the channel before. These are actually for the new Durango that's gonna be on the way. All right, guys, so they're all open. You can see them now. 
these are directional. So the two that I got standing up, if I'm not mistaken, should be for the right side of the vehicle, the passenger side. And then these, so that these are pointing out, should be for the, the driver's side. So they are directional. Big caps, again, 26s. And uh, they are for the new Durango. Like I said, it should be here. Should be here in a couple of weeks, hopefully. Hopefully I can get some footage before I go into my foot surgery. But yeah, guys, there we are. Man, I'm not gonna cry. That's over with. It's two years ago, y'all. Good memories, absolutely. Was it time for me to have all of that and do everything that I did? You know what? At the end of the day, it happened, right? That stuff had to take place in order for me to move into the life that I'm at now. And so everything happens for a reason. Even if we don't see it, a lot of the times God is working. And sometimes he might have to do things in your life to shake it up so you can get into the places that you need to be. Right now, man, I'm so happy that that happened because I'm in a place where I wouldn't even... I've wanted that type of stuff in my life, you know? And not to say that it wasn't a nice vehicle, but sometimes the life that you live in or the lifestyle that you have to live in order to obtain those things isn't always the greatest. So God is the greatest. I thank y'all for coming back to this channel. I thank y'all for watching me. I thank y'all for everything that we're about to do. And you know, the support in advance because we about to turn up, y'all. God bless.